If you stumbled upon this channel from a reel that you saw, hello and blessings to you. I just thought that as this channel starts to grow, I wanted to give a brief synopsis of me, why I even started this channel, some inspiration, and whatever else in this short video. I'll start this off by saying I'm Shatia. In 2021, September, I gave my life to Christ. Ever since then, it has been a whirlwind, but nonetheless, it has been a blessing above everything else. I would like to argue that this is when my life truly began to start even. This journey has been very liberating. <laughs> it has been very freeing. Just coming into this place of shedding my former self, the things that I used to do, who I used to be, and allowing God's life and his love to pour all over me. What do you call it? It's a metamorphosis of being a caterpillar and coming out of a cocoon into this beautiful butterfly and living your life as that butterfly. Now, as I said, this metamorphosis was not always beautiful. It was not always easy and it was not a one-step thing. It's kind of a continuous thing. We grow and we learn each day. Throughout the beginning, there was a lot of heartache, uncertainty, and a lot of hurt that had to be brought to the surface, that had to be digested, and had to be brought to light in order for it to even be removed and sorted through and to really dig deep into how how your identity as a believer, as a person was formed from the things that you went through. There were a lot of tears, um, church hurt, and times where I began to question, was this walk with God something I really wanted to do? Am I prepared to follow him as closely as some of our great leaders and spiritual fathers of the past? Am I willing to let go of my attachment to this world, let go of who I used to be, let go of opinions and follow God wholeheartedly, consciously, and with intent. Now, while I don't have all the answers and all the solutions, I know that God does. And I think one of the things that we often forget as believers is that God does not speak to us in just one way, whether it be dreams, visions, word of mouth, what have you. Sometimes it's directly through other people. And that is the most neglected source of God speaking to us. We forget that it comes in, in the form of a conversation, a video we watch, a book that we read, God is not limited in the way that he is trying to reach you and speak to you. God sends people to speak into our lives, to pour into us, to edify us, to point us back to him if all us fails. And that being said, that is what I want this channel to piggyback off of. Having these open conversations that you can have and God speak to you in something that that I may have said and something that I referenced and just allowing that to be a catalyst for you to seek God further on your own and to have that relationship, that intimate relationship that God so desperately seeks from you. I know it's a short video, but if you made it this far, thank you and blessings to you. May God grant you the desires of your heart. May you seek him in every matter, in every situation. May your eyes continuously be focused upon him and may your flip steps be ordered upon the path of the perfect will that he has for you. Blessing.